Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming where we are continuing our Let's Play on Rome Total War. Now, last episode we took some brutal battles against the Egyptians up here, one of which they managed to master out our infantry and we were only saved by our cavalry. Um, we also destroyed the Gauls up in Numantia that were, that were inside a fort, so we killed two more of their family members, so we only need to take Numantia and the Gauls are dead. Now, we have a weak army here defending against these guys. wonder who's attacked us. It looks like it was Captain Ramos who attacked us. So we need to deal with this army. Oh God, look at the infantry. We have two units of infantry. So we need to deal with this army before these guys come in. Because they are cavalry heavy and they have a bodyguard. So we need to deal with these guys as quick as we can. Whilst getting our auxiliar in. Our auxiliar should be coming behind us maybe or to the right and then the other army to the left so if we if we deploy on the left we should be should be in between the two armies so they can't Today meet up let's listen to what he has to, to say but better still to live and tell our grandchildren as yet unborn of brave romans who fought well those men are the servants of pharaoh they think themselves our equals but I think they are dead meat. Are you men enough to win this battle? Are you equal to the challenge? If you are, then plunder and loot await. This is the last obstacle in our way before the city walls. Win here, and you can stroll to your prize. So we want to fully destroy the second the army as well, so we get into the city Let without fight. themselves out against our battle line. They have a slight advantage in numbers, but our good spirits should counter that quite handily. That said, our skills, our training, and our tactics are second to none. Numbers can be deceptive. We have more horsemen than they, but their spearmen are many. We must be careful of them. I have fought these men many times, and even now they must be praying to their false gods for mercy. They will have little enough of it from me. Cheer! Our comrades are marching to our aid, even as I speak. I want to see blood. I want to bathe. He in loves their blood. blood. I want to bathe in their blood for a week. Now, kill them all. Yes, we will try and kill them all. You are right. Our our huge infantry contingent we can go here. We want to go to the left, kind of, to put a block between the two armies. Um, these, this one hoplite can stand there. I don't think there's going to be much, much help. But you guys can go there. You will actually be helpful, I think. Do we want to use them to will them down? I mean, could do. It's just, I don't know. It's, it's not really going to, not really going to have enough time. The reinforcements have arrived. This is hopeful news. I'll leave the hoplite. I mean, actually, no. Just, just go and attack. You come into the middle as soon as you can. Okay, they're coming from this corner. I'm sure we'll be able to defeat these guys before we have to worry about that. So, we'll come across here. I think they have a bonus in desert, don't they? So, need to be careful. A bit more careful than last time, maybe. Okay, desert cavalry. We'll go after them. Um... Cretan archers definitely fight the chariots. You do that. Oh, they've, they've run already. They've started running. <laughs> right, let's come back out. We will exact revenge on the Egyptians after what they have done to our armies. So many fallen brothers. Okay, those arrows should definitely be helping with the hit points. Oh, look at the camels. They're so slow. It's so annoying. Oh, no. Now, now we're in for it. Now we're in for it. Come here, come here, come here. Yeah, that's our infantry dead. It's just getting past the phalanxes to, uh, to fight the chariots. It's really, really annoying. Ah, get off them. Come on, get out. Idiots. Kill the chariots, please. Okay, okay the chariots are running. Be praised. The enemy get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. 
fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts. You can press here. Alright, while you're here, <laughs> they should run. Should stop them being in phalanx. Yeah, that's them gone. Alright, you guys charge the back of these. Can you fire at them? You go and fire at them as well. Is it only one chariot in this unit? Yeah, there is a lot of cavalry though, and they have a general bodyguard. Hmm. Not ideal. Okay, good, the uh, spearmen are here. We actually have some infantry. Uh, um, are they still turned? Yeah, they are. Good. Yeah, break them. Kill them. You come into the side of these guys. I should break them. I don't care about losing these camels. Oh, I do care about losing you, though. I thought they would turn the other way for a second there. Get up here, spearmen. Come up. Break are they? Okay, they've turned their they've turned their pikes. I'm fine using the camels as like a meat shield. Okay, do we have any other infantry? No. Wait, these four. Yeah, cool. Kill as many of them as you can. Those Nubian spearmen are fine. Right, this is the extent of our army now. It's literally on the last legs. It's, it's dregs. Pure dregs. Now you come back this way, and you come back this way. I want you to keep firing at the, at the chariots as much as possible, but you're going to get killed. Why are you over there? Just come over here and you'll be able to fire at the chariots. Stop being stupid. Come on. Yeah, this is our uh, this is our cavalry contingent. That's all that's left. Let's get them all in there. Oh, we don't want the uh, war starting. They can come here fire at the uh, Egyptian cavalry. That's the first thing we need to deal with is their general. I think we charged their general. That's what we've got. To, we've got to. That's the only thing we can do that's going to that's gonna swing this battle. I mean, if we get a charge off and they don't, it's a huge bonus to us. See, the, the cavalry, yeah. The chariots don't know what to do. And now his men fear us. I'm going to sandwich us. But, yeah, they're going to break. That's fine. Let's not run that way. Let's run uh, into the uh, chariots. They all go in. Are they all dead? Alright, Auxilia, you deal with these guys. You follow them as well. You fire at them. The chariot's going to escape. Surely not. Surely our equites are faster. Okay. The enemy army is in flight. Well, Receive try and get 87% the of these the guys. I don't think we're going to get it though. Um, you can. You uh, camels can go and fight the uh, Nile spearmen. <laughs> not going to make much difference. How much have we killed? 75. Yeah, I'm not sure we're going to do it, you know. Right. You go fight those guys. Uh, yeah, everyone just go fight them, I suppose. Ah! You need to uh, charge down them, because every single little enemy counts. They did escape with a lot of their cavalry and the chariots. I know it's not a lot of men, but I'm hoping hoping it's too little that they are completely destroyed and we can just enter the city like all everyone to go after these <laughs> don't think we'll reach look how slow the camels are jeez unbelievably slow okay <sighs> look at our our armies they are getting worn down uh, now Oh, it's Palmyra. I thought it was. How did Palmyra? How did it survive? Scythia, you want an alliance and map information? Oh, okay, that's that's fine. You're still just up there. You might help me against Ar uh, Armenia, honestly. What's in here? Hmm. 
We should be able to kill those just with our uh, just with our archers. Okay, we'll do the construction in a sec. Still, uh, still training these guys. Cool, good. Nearly for the urban cohorts. Well, we should be able to train legionary cavalry now. Let's get those. We'll send these four uh, Roman cavalry up to Elysia. Three turns it's going to take. Um, we'll have six infantry, so that's going to be ten. Plus Tertius, eleven. Plus four cavalry is fifteen. We need, a, we do need a few more troops. What are we? Oh, plus two is seventeen. 18, 19, 20. We'll just go with the cavalry. Uh, diplomatic information. Okay, Armenia. Yeah, because Armenia declared war on us. So, first things first, let's move this guy. Could do with some more. This is the only sort of surviving start army that we've had for a long time. We've been campaigning for a while. Um, this... this this army should be pretty close to being done very soon, honestly. Um, right. General, prepare for battle. Yep. Besieging God, we have no troops. Under I think we need to uh, bolster this force. So, yeah, they got some slingers. It's just killing this uh, this guy, the handsome guy, apparently. Are they got plague? No, the population grows just just going down because of the siege. I think. I was gonna say if they got plague, I don't want to take it. <laughs> um, right, spy. I want to see what's going on at the city. Why can't we just see the city, Jerusalem? Okay, not much. This spy. You come up to. So why can't we see these cities, Damascus? What do they have in here left? They have the chariots and that. Okay. Let's do the uh, buildings and then we'll probably... can't do that battle. We can do this battle. Um, that might be it. Unless this Armenian army has uh, siege equipment. They do now. So we'll have to do that battle as well. And then we're just waiting to restock all our armies honestly because we have been battered by the last, uh, the last few battles. Really tough. Yep, cool. Right, construction. Medellinium. Yep, you got the Hippodrome, so you're making legionary cavalry now. Do you have the armory? Yeah, you do. Good. Um, what do we want here then? Market, probably for money. Uh, Palmer, uh, doesn't matter. Actually, get rid of that. We don't want that. Serta, got highways, that's kind of good. Uh, probably the best thing here we want is a dockyard. Not a huge amount of corruption, a lot of trade. Yeah, that's a big increase, 150, that's really good. Uh, Thapsus, armorer again. Let's retrain all these guys if we can. We'll have to just retrain one of the guys next time. Larissa, dockyard. Hmm. Probably highways. Not, not adding a huge amount. Let's get some more law. Get rid of that corruption. Halicarnassus. They want happiness, really, but there's not much I can do about them being unhappy right now. Uh, Sinope. Hmm. If we got this, we'd be able to get Praetorian cohorts here. It's going to take too long. Let's get the roads because it'll help us move towards Armenia quicker. Um. So yeah. I mean, Egypt's still reasonably strong. Like these are, this is a large city. That's a large city. So, and that's a large city. So they still have the ability to train all their good troops, which is kind of scary, honestly. This is just a large town, so I'm, I don't think we'll be able to recruit anything from there. It's a large city, though. Um, keep on recruiting, definitely, hundred percent. Recruiting all down there. Right, the first battle we want to do is probably Palmyra. I'm hoping we can get rid of most of these guys. It's only 59, but the, the chariots are still an absolute pain. 
We won't listen to the general speech on this one because it's a lot smaller. We just want to get it over and done with. Uh, we'll just try and do it with the archers if we can, but I doubt we'll be able to. So we'll see. Oh, look at that. The 10 whole Prinker Bays. 14 has started. We'll get these guys in first because um, they're expendable. Right. You need to come forward. Same as the Cretans, same as these guys. Looks like looks like they're going to run away rather than take the arrows, which is sensible. Uh, but yeah, we want just want to get our auxilia set up and then get the archers behind them to fire at them. They might charge us at that point, but if they do, we'll have our generals close by to shred those chariots. Our soldiers have reached the gates with a battering This man. speedy could have auto resolved, but I think with the chariots in there, the auto resolve would have shredded like probably like 150, 200 kills to them, maybe, which is like half the army at this point. Battering ram has done its work. Um, Auxilia, get you in. Get you on guard mode as well. You guys come in. Cretans, and I think you guys can run over there, honestly. That's probably the best place for you to fire at them. And they might actually go after them, which is kind of good. Our soldiers have captured the walls! Now is the time to uh, press on and capture Doesn't look like we really need anyone else. I mean, we could bring these. I'll bring, I'll bring the Arab cavalry in just in case. The walls are broken. Just in case they decide to come through this way, but they'll they'll act as a buffer. The camels is ridiculously slow. It's so annoying. <laughs> Look at them go. They're literally going the same pace. Well, I know they're, they're kind of walking. That's them running though. It's not even running. It's literally jogging. Do we have any more Cretans in this mess? Yeah, we do. Okay, looks like they're going after the cavalry. They can do that if they want. Um, you just come back this way. Yeah, stop firing. Looks like the arrows aren't really getting there. Alright, Arab cavalry. Auxilia, Spearman, bonus against uh, Cavalry, so if they can get there, that'd be good. Could also just shred them with their bod General's Bodyguard. Let's do that. Not hugely bothered about losing many General's Bodyguards. I mean, I don't really want to lose uh, Lentilus uh, Gracchus. I think that's what his name is. So we'll rally him here so he stays behind. Bodyguards should do okay against them. Those Arab cavalry just got absolutely shredded. The one thing that's annoying about chariots as well is they're reasonably fast. Okay, more arrows are going into them, so... Yeah, good, good, good. Who have we got? What have we got left then? Oh, Desert Cavalry. Everyone just go charge them. They kill my general now. Will be upset though. Which they shouldn't do now. They got absolutely shredded. That's fine. Lost 39. I'm pretty sure the uh, auto resolve with the chariots would have been like 100, 150. Well, that's just another piece of land we've got. That's good. Now it's only a large town, so I don't really want to exterminate them. But uh, so let's go for the enslavement. Yeah, that's that's kind of paid off. Good. Um, Actually, first thing we want to do, rather than get the enemy roads, and looks like we can't train anything apart from let's train some more Roman cavalry. Cavalry swarm. This army is just pure cavalry. If we were up in the north with uh, the horse archers, it would be amazing. Right, you two, just come there. Oh, amazing! Let's get these. We should shred this army now then. Yeah, I'd rather be attacking from this side than the other side. We only have one horse archer. Um, first of all, let's get these 
Let's get two Eastern Mercenaries just as like... So bad, but just as a sort of meat shield. Tiberius. Cool. Yep. Get rid of these Armenians and then we'll keep on building our army over there to go to go east northeast Let's hear what he has now, to say you're probably wondering about this evening's entertainment there's enough wine in camp to float a boat it's all yours when they're dead oh yes and the camp women will be suitably appreciated too those men over there are the armenians they think they are our equals our enemies I think the carrion birds wait for them. They stand alone. No friend has come to this place to die for them. Does this not say something about their honor? They're standing among nations? Our task today is a noble one. To preserve the town and its people. We outnumber them by a small margin. From such small beginnings are great victories crafted. That said, their skills and training are formidable. More than force will be needed today. Tactical savvy at all levels is required. The enemy will try to conserve their strength by firing at us. We must close and fight them hand to hand, like true men. Those people have never met us on a field of battle. After today, they will flee at the sound of our approach. Cool. I think that's it. Be of good heart. No, no. For within the day, reinforcements will reach us. I want to see blood. I want to bathe in their blood. Amulius is bloody. They're all bloody. For a week. Now, kill them all. Yep, we will kill them all. Uh, they do have horse archers. That's the one thing that's going to be annoying. So we're going to try and use the Eastern Infantry, Eastern uh, Mercenaries to soak, them, soak up the horse archers. These Sarmatians are really good. Actually, they're not that good. They've just got a really good charge bonus. Good morale as well, powerful charge. Problem, pro I hate the ones that will charge without orders, like the Barbarian Cavalry. Ugh, these Roman Armoured Generals upgraded are just ruthless. Where's their army? That's actually good for us, you know. If they want to go in the corner camp, that's going to be good because the... Uh, the uh, their horse archers will be trapped. They won't be able to do anything. Now, where's their general? Not sure we'll be able to beat it just with this army, but we can try. I mean, worst comes to worst, Amuleus dies, and he's, he's very old anyway. So... I swear I ticked this should be mine. My army. Why are they not Why are they not under my control? I swear it's done this a couple of times. I swear it was unticked. Well, I guess we will have to just beat them like this then. Is that their general is horse archers? Go with the Cant Cantabri Cantabrian Circle. You just walk. These these poor Eastern infantry are just going to the slaughter. That's, uh, we need to get them trapped in the corner. Still on 55. What, who have we been firing at? These Peltists. Well, thank you for running away from the rest of your troops, Peltists. God, loads of them died in that charge, didn't they? Well, that is weak. That is so weak. Did not think they would be that weak. <laughs> Jesus. Look how many died in that charge. Wow. I know they are horse archers. They're not for charging, but... You know... I didn't think they. I thought like a, a charge from them would be okay, not terrible. I am really glad they've come into this uh, this side. Let's go after the Peltists. Let's go after the Eastern Infantry with those, with those guys. Like, they're probably gonna. A few people are gonna die, but it looks okay. Heavy cavalry coming in. Well, I mean, the Roman cavalry... Are they heavy cavalry? They surely should be like... Let's go after these archers if we can. Let's get you out. Wow, the Eastern Infantry is already running. Get over here. 
see whether we can chase these guys down. Wow, you killed, absolutely shredded the general there. Now we just need to kill these Eastern Infantry. We only got three units of cavalry to do that though. Now let's go, let's go fire at them and let's see what they do. Because they might, they might face this way. Those poor Eastern Infantry, we just used them as, as a meat shield and <laughs> they got, they got very much destroyed as a meat shield. I still want you to charge in because... I don't care about the Cant Cantabrian Circle anymore. So that we can charge these guys. Uh, why are the Roman Cavalry classed as Heavy Cavalry? I mean, I suppose they have seven armor. They're not brilliant though, not compared to Praetorian or... Um, what's the other cavalry? Is it Legionary Cavalry? No. Legionary Cavalry? Praetorian Cavalry, isn't it? That's the good one. Yeah, these guys kill these Eastern Infantry here. These guys have come back as well. We use these guys as a meat shield once again. Why are they going so slow? Come on. Okay, they're broken. I'm surprised their morale's been that good, these guys. Where's the rest of your unit? Oh, it's over there. They are running away. We tired, yeah, that's, I was going to say, we're going quite slow right now. Surely they're going to break. Yeah, they have. Good. Come on, we need these Eastern Infantry to fix the rest of these guys in, in position. Just walk over here. Okay, now you're going to have to run. Boom, straight in the back while they're turned. Mass route probably going now, hopefully. These guys are good. This AI army is just going so slowly. What are they doing? Let's get into them. Shaken, they're not wavering. Oh, they're wavering now. Good. I think if you double click they should take two steps forwards, or is that a different mod? Okay, these guys are wavering, good. Now these guys should. Yep, they're all wavering now. You get into the back of them. You get into them. The uh, Sarmatians started wavering. Uh, might be worth uh, charging these. Oh wow, I thought they would uh, they were gone. I thought they were wait they I thought they were routing, but it looks like they're not. We've only got the uh, general's bodyguard now. That's fine. Just wait until the rest of the guys come. Let's go kill the rest of them. 67%. Need to get above 85. Let's bring this guy around again. Oh, we'll meet these two guys up. I don't know what the AI is doing, but it's being really dumb. That's why I did not want the AI to... Uh... Quick, quick, just normal speed, please. Normal speed, normal speed, normal speed. Ah, come on. Oh, they, they broke. They just broke from being touched. Fair enough. Let's go kill them. Run them down. What percentage are they on now? 74. We still need to kill the rest of these, I think. So spread out. Oh god, what are they going to do? What's the AI going to do here? What are you doing? Kill them. Don't be so dumb, come on. Right, you go after them because we need to. How much are we on now? 82. I mean, they should break as soon as uh, they get touched. Oh, they've gone for the charge. The Good. Enemy army is in flight. Actually Pursue worked. Them and well drive done. Them from the battlefield. <laughs> they got the peasants. They're bringing. They're bringing the hordes of peasants. Did we make it? Did we make it to the battle, sir? No. You're too slow. And you would be useless anyway. I mean, I would. I would have the eastern infantry over peasants any day. But... Jesus, look at that. Most of that is the Eastern Infantry, though. That's fine. Victory! 
need to retrain. Uh, oh, it's Vibius. I thought it was Amuleus. Amuleus is the other guy, isn't he? Out of move, sir. Need to, yeah, I need to retrain all of these. I mean, the Sarmatians don't really matter. Should probably give Tiberius some of these retinues. Like, the Eastern Turncoat will be helpful. The Military Tribune will be helpful. Turncoat Slave, probably don't really need that. Slave Trader? No, probably don't really need that either. Hmm. Cool. So, the battles today have been kind of harder than they should have been, really. I'm hoping we get Rhodes here and they can make it in two turns from Hatra. How are we doing over here? Cool. So I think we'll take one more turn and let's see where everything goes. So in Aretium we have nearly six units of the Praetorians. And then, I mean after this one we'll be able to get a couple of units of urban cohorts as well. We'll have four legionary cavalries, ah, or do we get six legionary cavalries and four archers? Probably that, honestly. It's probably the best thing we can do. Because cavalry we've seen is so powerful. Could even get only like six urban cohorts. Oh, Jesus. Well, I'm not going to fight that. No point. There's no point. We're not going to win. They'll go to Palmyra anyway. What's this? I have archers. Just auto do that. And I'll go back to Hatra. We'll send a few more over together. Looks like we need to move out of to Oh, no. Well, we need to go deal with the Armenians then. We're going to keep doing this. Yes, we definitely need another general over there, so let's do that. I think I should have gone into Mazaka. No. Oh, it's Amuleus. Who, where's Amuleus? There's Amuleus over here. Orders. Was he the other way? Hmm. Has he gone into Narbo? Arrhenius Julius, about over here. It's just gone to the capital. No. It was Amuleus, wasn't it, that was the uh, benefactor? Where is Amuleus? That's Amuleus, right? Amuleus is in Tarsus. Okay, so he's here. That's actually good. We want another general here. We probably want him with Tiberius. So we'll send him back to Tiberius. Don't know what we're going to do about that. I think we're just going to have to take the L there. Um, unless we march... We need to take Antioch, really. Hmm. Okay, town grows Sardis. Yep, cool. That's good. That should get rid of the culture penalty there for quite a bit. Agent found in Mazaka. Yep, Hatra, Armenia. Aretium. Yes, that's good. Start getting the urban cohorts. They are just so much better. Like, they are just so OP, it's ridiculous. Six. I mean, honestly, we could go with seven if, we've get, if we get enough cavalry, but I don't think we're going to get enough cavalry. Carolus, yeah, Carolus is just training. Athens, we got the... We got that. Cool, that's good. Let's get uh, the public health. Kydonia, paved roads. Uh, we're just building everything until we can upgrade in Kydonia. Roads. Yep, that should be fine. Uh, Narbo Martius, we've upgraded. Awesome. Let's get the roads probably first. Got corruption out here because it's so far away from the capital, but. It's okay. We'll get rid of it with our Temples of Jupiter. Pergamon. Hmm. Public order here isn't amazing, especially seen as we're on low. So let's get the arena and then probably the temple. Uh, Elysia. 
Let's get that for public order and retrain these guys. Uh, Mazaka. Hmm. Let's get that so we can get some archers. Although, can we get archers from Sinop? I think we can. We'll have a look in a sec. Memphis. Let's get the public health because it's a big city. No, we want we want military stuff here. So blacksmith. Tarsus. What do you want here? Probably health. Palmyra. More roads. Quicker to get around. Quicker for them, I know as well, but that's fine. Now, the best outcome of this for us would be if those Egyptians went and killed the Armenians up there. That would be amazing. Um, right, Serbia. Yeah, we'll send you round because that's where we need you. Hmm. This army's reasonably strong, honestly. We don't need all those peasants. They've just been collecting peasants. No, it's okay. Um, is there any we can sort of mix? Yeah, we'll put those two together. And then we'll get this auxilia into here. And we'll stick you in there. Tars is still happy. Good. And we need to take Antioch. I think we'll be attacked here, honestly. But it might be a bridge battle. So that would be fine. Although, hmm, if we're attacked from both angles, we might be sandwiched. But I suppose, you know, <laughs> let's uh, let's lose all the men in that unit as well. That's fine. <laughs> right, over here, how are we doing? Hmm, can't send those archers up that way. Getting some of these Praetorians. Let's take Thebes, that'd be good. Um, we're recruiting... Yeah, that's recruiting more cavalry over here. That's good. Let's keep it going. Probably just want a couple of auxilia to, to man the rams. Can't do anything about this. No chance we're going to beat that, I don't think. I mean, we'll fight it when they attack, but that's fine. Now over here, Herius. Move you there. Build the rams. Um, Narbo... Let's move Captain Kanaizal, whatever he's called up there. Hmm. We do want a full stack for this because we are going to be fighting against the Bretons and they're not weak. The one good thing about having early legionary cohorts is we're more likely to get them retrained. Let's uh, send you up there as well. Then when we get those two, those cavalry, we'll sort it out. Cool. Uh, you're coming into here. Retrain you guys. How are we looking on the cavalry? So we have one, two, three. We honestly want about six. We will just keep on recruiting forever here, though. Because um, we'll keep recruiting stacks. We need more and more stacks, especially as the uh, other Roman factions get stronger. Right, so this has got four Praetorians. It's got 6, so that's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, uh, 16, 15. Oh, we need another general over here, really. Could just send them out without um, without a general and hope to get a man of the hour. Don't know whether that's going to do anything, though. Right, like, There's no guarantee we'll get a man of the hour. If they want to attack us here, they can do. They've literally got Peltasts. They're not going to do anything. Now this is a full stack in here, but we're not worrying about the uh, Numidians just yet. Cool. I think that's everything, guys. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, please do consider subscribing, liking, and commenting which um, of your of the Total War games is your favourite and most nostalgic. So thank you very much, guys, for watching, and hopefully I should see you again on the next video.